Hello everybody, how are you all doing? My name is Ravel and thank you for watching today's video and oh my god, I have to tell you, they really fucked up with this one. I mean, I didn't thought that they could actually screw up the optimization system so much. So I want you to just see my reaction to when I first figured out how this shit works and then we're gonna talk about everything. And I need to destroy 229 masks? What? Are they insane? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, this is so disgusting. 66 bosses? 117 control points? That's like 20 something, that's like almost 30 control points, dude. 46? <laughs> Oh my god, they really fucking outdid themselves with this one, man. I'm telling you. So that was like my genuine reaction, right? And uh, I, re already, I already recorded this video once, but I was all over the place because of how like pissed I was with the decisions that I make. And I decided to like re-record it and be more clear and more to the point, right? So as I told you in that clip um, before, the, the amount of resources that they're actually asking us to farm for is simply insane right so they want us for example right here to farm 229 masks about 30 control points because each control point at heroic gives you four of these the bosses right now i think are glitched because in order to complete a control point you have to kill two named enemies and i obviously did but I didn't get any of this and it was like the right faction because each item has a different uh, requirement for what boss you need to kill. For example, Mask needs needs you to kill uh, Hyenas, but if we go to like, let's say Assault Rifles, right? And try to like increase our rate of fire, Jesus fucking Christ, what are these numbers? Uh, you need to kill two sons over here, as you can see, right? So, what I was saying, yeah. Back to the mask where is it where is where is it? so yeah and about 46 shd collaboration or whatever the fuck it's called which you get from weekly and mission a uh, weekly and daily uh projects now here is where everything like falls apart i mean it has already fallen apart because of the numbers that they're asking us to farm but just check this out right so you go to your daily and weekly no shd collaboration one is HD calibration, five, no SHD. This one I already did, no SHD, no SHD, no SHD, no SHD, one, and five. And now look, just look at this here. This is a weekly project, right? Uh, you forcing me to go into the dark zone, which by the way, your dark zone suck in this game. So the majority of the player base, especially the PVE players, don't even, Consider going to the dark zone because their, their experience in there is pretty terrible, but let's just not talk about that But not only you're forcing me to go into the dark zone. You want me to actually kill 10 agents And not only that kill 10 rogue. I think it's 10 rogues, right? I think because it says neutralize agents. I don't know if neutralize means uh, Killing rogues or just killing any agent. Uh, I don't know exactly the Meaning of neutralize, yeah, I'm a dumb fuck, sorry for that, but but at the end of the day, you're forcing me to PvP when for two almost two years now we have been telling you that PvP sucks. So you're locking the the, the optimization station be, be, behind those projects and these projects. I mean, don't get me wrong, some people might actually enjoy doing projects, but but some people obviously don't. I don't know, man. Uh, but what I figured out, because I'm not done, uh, what I figured out is that you can actually like farm for a, a blueprint of this yet, and you can actually craft SHD calibration, so you don't actually have to do the projects, but you can actually craft them, craft the SHD calibration. But just look at how expensive they are. Like, 1,000 titanium, 1,000 carbon fiber, and 1,000 electronics. I mean, fuck the credits. Nobody cares about those. They're, they're useless. But 1,000 electronics and titanium? I mean, who thought this? Who, who are the people 
that took these these, these decisions. Like, I really would like to like see how they figure out that that is a system that would actually work for six for zero point six percent critical hit damage from ten point eight percent to eleven point four percent. I need to farm two hundred twenty nine masks, and then I need to farm like. 229 masks 30 control points 66 hyena bosses For 0 0.6 This is just the so okay, so the, this is like a big company that actually publishes games and it's like responsible for updating them and, and blah blah blah, right? So nobody from those people that actually work in there thought and told the others that you know what in those 229 masks he will probably find one that's much better than this piece of shit that i have in front of me right now so the whole fucking point of having an optimization station is to not go f to farm for the perfect roles that require you to farm 200 300 400 masks but you actually defeated that purpose by actually making it even harder. I mean, the chances of me getting a God Royal Mask, and I can actually prove it on stream if you challenge me, is that I would actually get a God Royal Mask much faster with the exact roles that I won, right? Without having to, much faster than actually optimizing it. Because this is, the max critical hit damage is 12. I don't even see what it would take me to, to get to like the next um, the next uh, tier of optimization because I heard, I read, I'm not sure about that and I'm never gonna be sure apparently because I will never optimize anything but I heard that the higher uh, you're trying to like optimize your, your item so let's say that now I'm tier 9 because obviously then I have one more tier in order to reach the guard roll of the critical heat damage which is 12 so in order for me to go from 11.4% to 12% critical heat damage is gonna be much more expensive than it is for me to go from 10.4 10 10.8% 10, 10 to 10 to 11.4% and oh my god this is just the, the, the just this this over here just shows how out of touch with the, the community these developers are and how embarrassing it is for uh, a company like this one to have such a great game because the, the idea behind the vision is actually awesome and that's why so many people love this game and the graphics are insanely good and the game offers for so much fun and replayability but these people behind the wheel are like not even capable of like creating a bet at, at the moment like what the fuck is this 229 masks are you out of your goddamn mind that's why they fucking increased your, my fucking backpack, backpack space because now they know that I need to fill my inventory almost one and a half time for just the fucking for just 0.8% critical heat damage. You fucking suck. Uh, this is just so fucking sad. Um, let me see. Did I actually got optimization cast? Let's see what this shit gives us. Wow. Wow. Just wow. Anyways, um, that's it pretty much the video, guys. Uh, th this, whoever designed this shit over here, I don't know what to say about him, but uh, I'm not gonna be using it. And, you know, honestly, I don't think that anybody should be using the optimization station. The grind is simply not worth it. Just try to farm a better piece or be a better weapon or whatever you're looking for it, it's it's gonna be you're gonna get it much faster than you're actually gonna be done uh, optimizing uh, a, a whole item the, the, that's just my thoughts on it anyways have a wonderful day bye bye